Well, because I'm I'm done here and I'm not gonna go home with you. What you mean I'm going home with you? I mean, I pay for the dinner. Normally, you come home with me. So you mean if you pay for the dinner, then I should go home and sleep with you? How much you pay for the dinner? Well, see, that's why you got to establish the dating parameters before you even go out on a dinner date. Uh, listen, hey, baby girl, look. Before we do this and I pay for this food, am I going to get the kitty cat? But why should it have to be? Why can't we just go out on a date and go eat? Why do you have to have sex after it? It's because I'm trying to eat that kitty cat. <laughs> Video number four. Oh. We got a date night that went wrong. A woman gets pressed by her date for not going home with them after he paid the bill. Yeah. Oh, he was on some. Oh, he's like, yeah, I want, I want that yitty yak. I paid for the cookies. <laughs> you I want the, the cooking screen. Goodness gracious! It's this jump podcast. <laughs> oh. Let's go. Sorry, what did you just say to me? Why you order a taxi? Because I need to go home. Why you want to go home? I think you come home with me. Well, because I'm I'm done here and I'm not gonna go home with you. What you mean I'm going home with you? I mean, I pay for the dinner. Normally you come home with me. So you mean if you pay for the dinner, then I should go home and sleep with you? How much you pay for the dinner? It's not about the dinner, but I pay like 2.6 million. Oh, so you think that I'm just worth 2.6 million? I don't say that, but you know, just come home with me. No, no, no. Okay, how about you? I, I give you 2.6 million back. And I then I, I can go, right? I don't need it. So what do you want from me now? Come home with me now. No, no, I am going home now. I don't like you. Oh, so you're not coming home with me right now. No. Ah, okay, then next time, don't waste my time. I don't like you. Yeah, what do you say? I don't like you. <laughs> well, I mean, that's that's fair. Because let's just say she was communicating with him through texting on the phone and then she and I've I've encountered this before. Um mm -hmm. and then she went on a date with this guy and didn't really got a chance to see what he was like and didn't really like him. But like see I've, that but I've see come across something like that. But at the end of the day, when I go on a date with somebody, I'll meet you there. You're not coming to pick me up. But see, that's why you gotta establish the dating parameters before you even go out on a dinner date. Uh, listen, hey baby girl, look. Before we do this and I pay for this food, am I going to get the kitty cat? But why should it have to be? Why can't we just go out on a date and go eat? Why do you have to have sex after it? It's because I'm trying to eat that kitty cat. So, <laughs> y'all, I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> I'm going to be in the, middle, in the middle here. So, I'm, I was trying to look up some, some, um, some currencies. Yeah. They kind of sound like they was in, like, you know, the Asia area somewhere. So, I looked up the yen. I looked up a couple of them. They was very... The, the, I, I, uh, I think was it the yen? Wasn't because that would have been like a seventy-one thousand dollar date. God, I know he ain't spend that. Damn. So when I looked up, oh, you the, give it up, the but Indonesian currency, two point six million Indonesian, I guess it's rupees or rupees, is one hundred and sixty-three U.S. dollars. US. So I think okay. that's where they was at in Indonesia somewhere. Oh, uh, okay. So one hundred sixty-three dollars ain't really nothing. So this is what. Y'all gotta start doing, fellas, so you don't look like hornballs out here. Not cornballs, hornballs. Yeah, tell them, make it, tell them, bro. Cat Williams said, before you go, before you go out and you think you want to try to sleep with a woman, go knock yourself off real quick, dust yourself off, mm -hmm. and then go out. Cause then once you spend the money, you ain't even really worried about getting the cootie cat. And then you could actually feel like, all right, do I really like her? Cause now you ain't worried about, you know, you know, getting the cootie cat. So I'm telling y'all need to take that advice because some of y'all, y'all can't keep equating. That goes for the, women too. And say it again. What you say? I said that goes for women too. No, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. We got we got to pull that back. You know why? Because the women that's giving up the cootie cat, it ain't too many men is turning it down. Nine out of ten men is taking that. Now on the women's side, I'm not a woman, so I don't know. I think it's more like thirty percent that's going down with that. But on the men's side, women, if y'all want to still offer it, <laughs> Lord have mercy. But, but throw, it in, throw it in the bag. Yeah, but see, the Let's reason why I say it. the reason Let's Let's look look at her y'all. Look, <laughs> see, <laughs> see, see? <laughs> the re the reason why I say that must be established before you go out on a date. <laughs> if you're talking to a woman, or you or you meet a woman, you first meet a woman, talking to her on the phone, you know 
that conversation on the phone if, if the date is going to be a good date. Yeah. You should know that because it. the conversation you have on the phone, even on the date, if you're having a, and the vibe is good, the chilling is good, when that, when that way to say, well, bring you the bill. Nah, we ain't ready to leave yet. Because that means nobody's ready to go because you're having a good time. Or, yo, man, give me, give me a couple more drinks. Or, or, we're not ready in this or, night yet. No, or pay agree. attention to the sexual cues. Yeah, if y'all baby. having conversation and y'all talking about, you know, some sexual things that, mm. you know, it's starting to look oh, like, God. then that's when you say, okay, now let me see if I can try to finesse this Got going forward. Parlay this date yes. even, even a couple hours. If y'all just sitting around talking about Walmart and talk about work and all that, that does not equate to you getting no yams. Yeah. You're going to play not, yourself. Exactly. Oh, go, go ahead, T. Mm. Cause you over there talking about how, yeah. how, 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 no, how, because the reason why I'm saying it is because I had this guy I was talking to and literally from the first time we talked on the phone he just kept bringing up sex I'm like what the hell I said why you keep bringing but that that's up not a, that's not going to equate to a good date okay so I, I realize that now not then <laughs> so we go on a date right oh, cause I told to be him you still right. the hands early. so look I told him I said look I don't even know you I said I haven't even been around you I said all we did was just talk on the phone <laughs> so we go on a date. Mm-hmm. By the end of the date, he was like, "Okay, do you know me well enough now to go?" Them thighs I said, is all in my eyes. I said, "What?" <laughs> <laughs> I said, "No." I had to like literally. I had to like literally the next day tell him like, "No, I can't do this." I said because it seems like every conversation is always leading to you know sexual interactions, and I'm like, not to mention you was ignorant as hell but, when we was but, at the restaurant. See, that, oh, see I respect the man because I do. He came straight from the top. He said, "Yo, he, he shot, did. shot, said, he shot his shot from the rip." <laughs> You know what I mean? But I, again, as as an observant man, you would know like, yo, if I take this girl out, it's going to be a good date because our phone conversation is vibing. I know. And so then when we go on a date, the date is vibing. And you know what? When it be honest, I'm going to tell you that I can't say for all men, when a date is vibing, you're not even thinking about this this, this section. You're thinking about no. extending this date even longer, yo. Let's go somewhere else. Hell, let's go take a walk somewhere because uh, I, 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 I do not want this date to end. I was ready to go. He was so rude to the, to the waitress. I was like, I, and I kept asking him. I said, I kept saying to him, I said, look, don't worry about the waitress. I'm good. Well, she ain't give you your water yet. I'm like, just focus on me. Just, just talk to me. He was focused on you. <laughs> he wanted them yams. <laughs> them thighs is all this on yeah, my man. Mind. Look, that man. You know, you know, know how to do it. I, 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 I took the check. I'm like, miss, let me borrow your pencil and I'll draw a, a dick right on the back of that damn receipt and I'll just slid it to you. <laughs> yeah, what's up? You want that right there? <laughs> <laughs> and you'd have been like, well, what's this? My dick! <laughs> Why did I not know? It was about to lead to that. Oh my gosh. Here you go! <laughs> I'm not messing with you. I'm not messing with you. You don't know what you're leading to that. Man. Oh, man. Oh, man. It's crazy. Boy, I'm trying to tell you. <laughs> but, but you got to be observant, man. Yes. Because I'm not, listen, I'm not about giving out no free meals. And, and, and let me play devil's advocate. Ladies. Look, you ain't got to give out no free meals because listen, I ain't got no problem paying. Ladies, <laughs> do me all. a favor. Do not put that energy out there if you don't want the man to, to, to pounce on that. So we got to be mindful of that, too. Yeah, mm-hmm. fellas, don't be looking horny. Pay attention to the cues. Yeah, if, pay there attention, yes. if there ain't nothing sexual really going on, <clears throat> chill out. But women, don't make it seem like... Don't be seductive and all that. Don't be feeling all on yourself and all. Shit, I wasn't. Look, no, I'm not saying. I'm not saying. This, I'm not this saying dude coming saying, from the damn gym. I'm not saying that you <laughs> did that. I'm just saying in general, because as a man, yeah, my my my, my sexual uh, tendencies are heightened because you're a new woman. So I'm looking at you. Ooh, cool. Don't mm-hmm. be doing all this extra stuff, like making it look like we gonna get into something. And then and I we ain't enough. Yeah, like that's weird to me. So like don't do that either. But yeah, fellas, be chill. I'm not I'm an introvert. I can't I can't put my business out on the streets, but I done did a lot. <coughs> and I ain't even had to do it. That's why I said I, I do a lot, but I don't do the most. Cause I don't do the <laughs> most and it, right and it got me a lot because I wasn't doing the most. So y'all just gotta chill. But wait a minute, T, let me ask you something. Have you ever been on a date 
with a man who wasn't pressed, but you like, damn, why he ain't pressed for this? I'm trying to give him this. I got that email. too. I, I, no, you never. Nope. Ever. No, that's one thing. I'm never. I never pressure myself on no guy to give him none of me. Hell no. Mm-mm. All of me. So my thing is, is like, first of all, if I'm thinking it, my body actions or my body reactions are not going to show it. So no. <laughs> like, excuse me, this why is your nipples on? <laughs> it's not even it's ninety degrees in here. <laughs> oh, you got up. The seat is a little wet. Did you pee on yourself? <laughs> yeah, I mean, man, listen, you got it. You, you got, it, fellas. So and it has ladies. been times that I was thinking about it, but did I did I act on act it? On no, it? no, not at all. But but I'm, I'm but the see, type of person. I'm real calm. I'm collective. You know, I'm just, but I'm real laid back. I. You know I get Chill. crazy. Chill. You know yeah. I get crazy. I you know I could get a little nasty. <laughs> yeah. 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 You know what I mean? But 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 it's it's up to a man to pick up on those cues. Yes, well. You know what I'm saying? Come on. You're too old to Yeah, we talk talking, man, because uh, you, you, look, you look like a goddamn fool. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Look, I paid the bill. We're going to get some sex tonight. That's called prostitution, yeah. sir. <laughs> you done solicited some <laughs> prostitutes. Look, let me tell you something. You know if a man get butt or not by the way he acts. Is octopusy in you? I mean, d- just grabbing all on you and you know what I mean? No, you know, he ain't getting no sex. No yams. He ain't getting no yams. None. But if a man say, hey, go, baby, you know, two hundred dollars and shit, pay that bill, say you like, oh, is this man getting pussy? I better hurry up and give him my pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. No, thank you. Because if you acting like that, no way in the world I want to share what you got going on. That's what they call that community dick. <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong with being a man from the community. <laughs> I don't want it. Yeah, I, feel, I don't I want feel it. It was cool to be a committee yeah, member. Yeah, yeah, there. <laughs> hey, like, Los, what you do for a living? Really? I am a community <laughs> organizer. <laughs> I work with the people. <laughs> yeah, with the people, for the people. For the people. <laughs> Y'all is a mess. <laughs> yeah, that guy, they not wrong, that guy. We, we men, we supposed to procreate and sling, sling mm-hmm. our. You know what yeah, I mean? Our, our, that's what you're supposed so to do. So our royal oats. Yeah, so, yeah, like, so, see, are so are we oats. supposed to do that. Mm-hmm. Okay. The K-Men. <laughs> Hit you upside your head. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hit you upside your head with what? Yeah, yeah Greg, with that damn. <laughs> <laughs> Look, TJ, stop it. <laughs> Why you always get him started? <laughs> Grab you by, drag you by your feet, goddamn it! <laughs> Pull you into the cave, do them things to you. <laughs> no diddy, yeah, no okay. diddy, no diddy. Yeah. <laughs> hey, like, what's that? I got a husband's bulge. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, take my glasses.